Okay guys, welcome back. It's freaking engine time. Unfortunately, that's what we're replacing in that big boy out there. Okay, gotta move some stuff around. Now time for the big boy. Alright, here we go. Dive in. All right, there it is. You guys have seen my other 6.7 videos and have obviously seen me unwrap a 6.7. Um, but we're gonna try to assemble the fuel system. Um, all new injectors, lines, rails, high pressure pump, and kind of uh, quickly show you what you gotta do. So, um, I guess here we go. Alright, we're all unwrapped. Brand new looking. I like the way this engine looks. But unfortunately, when you screw up maintaining it, who's to blame? Not that. So, here's some of the stuff that comes in the fuel system. We got the high pressure pump. We got a bunch of lines. We have our return hose. We have all eight fuel injectors. Tricky. And we have both fuel rails. Let's see where all of our parts are from. Okay, what do we got? Where's this from? Czech Republic. Okay, we got another Czech Republic. That pump I already showed you, that was Czech Republic. We got the made in Turkey. And then we got all the fuel lines. Of US origin, made in Japan. All right, that's cool. That's cool, that's cool. So we're gonna go ahead and put both these off the engine and uh, get our own strapped. Out of there. All right. So, all this stuff out the way, and yeah, we're gonna just start on packaging a few things and start laying it out. Oh, and I forgot one more box. This one said Japan. And we got the engines, the lines that run on the engine, and the uh, quick disconnect there quick disconnect for the fuel rail by the driver's side just realized that I'm not gonna be able to continue on because I got a few other things I got to do before the day's end but uh, I'll show you what else I got going on got an electric focus that the bearings took a, a dump on Unfortunately, all that metal shrapnel went into the trans and the electric motor. So, um, yeah, I gotta replace all that. I don't know if you guys recognize what this is from. It's from that. And it's a 2018. We just put uh, grinding the front cover down and uh, 
got to mock it up so we can run a little more clearance off the front cover. But we got a new uh, phase one blower on here. And uh, we got to put the intercooler on, the radiator, and a couple of other things. But it's pretty much, pretty much done. Get it buttoned up, done. Hopefully on Monday. Got to put the uh, the bracket on right there. We got to grind off a little bit more metal. To put the bracket on for the uh, feed belt. And uh, get back rocking and rolling. Still got a bunch of Roush stuff to put on. So, all right, you guys. This video is gonna be a little short this week, but uh, tell me guys what you think about this in the comment section below. Got 650, 750 we're doing the engine on. And uh, don't ever forget, it's a heavy load. Do not double stack. Until next week, guys. Thanks for watching.